Billy Cunningham, the great American, about Jerry Sandusky once again and the assistant head basketball coach at Syracuse. More and more older men in their 20s and 30s are coming out to talk about sexual abuse when they were boys or young teenagers. To me, this is a disgusting secret of NCAA basketball, football, and many other sports. Hopefully, this will, this will provide license to many in the tri-state or around the nation that suffer the abuse at the hands of these pedophiles that now feel as if they can come out and tell the truth. More of Jerry Sandusky's victims are coming forward. One of the worst things he did, PR-wise, which, which to me is completely irrelevant, is to do that interview with Bob Costas. That was stupid because it sparked the outrage of boys who had been molested by Jerry Sandusky over the years and decades to come out and to contradict the conflicted uh, words of one Jerry Sandusky. What's happening now at Syracuse is also very sad. Jim Beheim, for whom I have great respect, has thrown his body on top of this assistant head coach who supposedly had sex with some of the ball boys going back years and years ago. Two have come out so far, and I predict many others will. If you're a Boy Scout leader, if you're in a charitable group, if you're a soccer coach, a basketball coach, keep your eyes open to the abuse of young boys. It, it happens everywhere, including the Roman Catholic Church. Billy Cunningham, 700 WLW.